Welcome back. Let's get into today's trending stories. It's time for Hot Topics, brought to you by Mean Girls at Walton Arts Center. It's been two decades since a certain school of witchcraft and wizardry made its way into the hearts of millions. What you're seeing right now, it's a sneak peek of Return to Hogwarts. Daniel Radcliffe, Emma Watson, Rupert Grant, and a host of other cast members will join director Chris Columbus for a retrospective on the first film, Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. The reunion will air New Year's Day over on HBO Max. I'm excited about it. The whole family's excited about it. I wonder if the kid, the kids in the show, and they're not kids anymore, are they, Daniel Radcliffe? I wonder if they're excited about it. I'm sure they are. There's another picture of the three of them posted on um, HBO Max's Instagram, and it's like, oh! Uh! My yeah, eyes, yeah, because they just look so grown up, and of course they are, of course, because they're adults. But uh, I'm excited about this yes, too. Very, yeah. very excited. <laughs> I'm just laughing randomly. Sorry. All right. Now, if you're looking to take a break, <laughs> this next story is hilarious. If you're looking to take a break from rom-com holiday movies, which I've been stuck in right. since I've been October, in that honestly. Vortex. Truth. Yes. Yes. Uh, check out this trailer. This is for the film Silent Night. It stars Kira Knightingly, who whose character Nell is hosting Christmas at the end of the world. Right. Now she's gathered friends and family together for one last party as a poisonous cloud moves towards them. Now the film is in theaters now, also starring Lily Rose Depp and uh, Matthew Good. Yes. This is hilarious. I'm in. <laughs> Just thinking about like what, what kind of dinner are you serving if I you have. know for sure like the world is the world's ending? Coming in. Yeah. Who are you inviting? Like who's gonna be at that table with you? These are hard decisions. That's, that's a rough one. <laughs> and I think it's interesting because I think a lot of people know Kira from uh, Love Actually. Right. She has a big role in that. And now this is entirely different for yeah. the holiday season. Wow. Interesting. Well, this year was big for dog lovers. And with the holidays here, you may have your eye on adding a furry friend mm -hmm. to your family. So if you need some inspiration on what to name your pet, we got a few ideas for you. Rover, an online marketplace, has compiled a list of the year's most popular dog names. So check it out. Top female names are Bella, Luna, Lucy, Daisy, and Zoe. Cute. And Cute. the top five male dog names, Max, Charlie, Cooper, Buddy, and Milo. Now for That's cat true. lovers, which I know we're cat owners yeah. here, uh, Luna and Max are the top names that did not make the top five list but grew in popularity. Here are a few, few of those names. Can you believe it? Of course you will. Fauci. <laughs> COVID and Zoom. Yeah. Pet names growing in popularity. That is very interesting. I do like Zoom. I think that's kind of cool. I think, I think that's kind of cool too. You know, I think they're it cute fancy. names. I like those cute names. The other names are like human names. Yeah. I feel like at one point we named dogs, I don't know, they were more like dog names. Yeah. Now we're calling them Milo and <laughs> Betty and Johnny, I don't Fauci. know. Kind of Fauci. 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 Come go. Fauci. Come <laughs> Fauci. <laughs> All right, well, a new Broadway show is coming to the Walton Arts Center, and it's so fetch. Mean Girls <laughs> makes its Arkansas debut Tuesday, December 14th, and will run through Sunday, December 19th. Now, it follows the story of Katie Heron and what happens when she tries to dethrone Queen Bee. Regina George. This Ooh. is going to be a good one. So yes. make sure you get your tickets now. We do have a link for that over on our website. Probably my favorite quote from Mean Girls is, I'm not a real mom. I'm a, I'm a cool mom. Oh, yeah. That's a good one. That's, that's my favorite one. I like it. Don't stop trying to make fetch a thing. Isn't that part yes. of it? Yes. I love yes, that one, too. I can't wait to see it. We're, we're headed there, I think, uh, next weekend. So, okay, good. Yeah. I expect all the quotes from you then next You'll week. You'll get a whole show just of me quoting Mean Girls. <laughs> nice. Everybody will tune out for that.